Hi everyone and welcome to our channel. Today we're talking about our top 5 tips for camping with your son or daughter. <laughs> Depends. So number one is arrive as early as you can to the campsite. Uh, if you get there uh, late already and you're rushing to put up the tent uh, and make dinner, <clears throat> you will only make it hard. Um, your son will try to touch things and you're running about trying to do your things and take care of your son at the same time. Depends. Our second tip is to get your son involved in everything related to camping from putting up the tent, to making dinner, to uh, putting the tables, the chairs, uh, putting air in the hair mattresses if you have them, whatever you can to make it uh, an experience, uh, camping by itself and not only going uh, somewhere. We uh, even went as far as staging uh, a little accident with the tent, uh, that really put a smile on his face and after a long drive that's what you want to do uh, all the activity to be as fun as possible our third tip is to buy uh, bug spray uh, our son apparently has a mosquito allergy so as soon as we arrived he got bitten by I think five mosquitoes and a couple of those bite marks really really grew and we had to rush to the pharmacy while we were there the pharmacist recommended um, a bracelet for, for the young kids well he loved it he he was always looking at the bracelet putting the mosquitoes at bay with that bracelet and before going to sleep he was checking if he still had it and telling us this is for the mosquitoes throughout the rest of the days we stayed camping he actually didn't get any uh, mosquito bites since um, using the bracelet so thumbs up we recommend it our fourth tip is to use a foam mattress instead of those um, air mattresses. Our son sleeps in one of those uh, cribs and he actually likes to sleep uh, with his back uh, against uh, the wooden bars and when we were camping he was turning and turning and turning and falling off the air mattress then we would put him back uh, and again he would fall uh, the next time we went camping, we actually took one of those foam mattresses and he slept a, a lot better. It's not as tall and most importantly, um, the mattress doesn't flip over like those air mattresses. Um, the other ones, he would turn, turn, turn and when he would reach the, the edge of the mattress, the <laughs> mattress would turn and that's what, what would wake him up. So yeah, a foam mattress is way better for, for young um, kids uh, than a, an air mattress. Our fifth tip is to explore as a family. Uh, take advantage of the outdoors, let him roam free, uh, let him touch things and really make it an unforgettable experience. Um, most kids nowadays are used to staying in the house or they go to kindergarten but they're kind of indoors they don't have a lot of freedom to, to roam and to, to just touch and feel and experience things so really use your time camping to, to make it an unforgettable experience as much as you can lastly if you want to get some more advices there's um, a really good blog uh, that unfortunately we didn't read uh, before our first time camping so we didn't take bug spray <laughs> which they recommend but we will leave the link down below and the website is explore as a family which is a really cool name that's it for this week's video 
If you want to help us uh, and enjoy watching our videos, don't forget to subscribe uh, and to click that little bell so you get notified as soon as our new videos come out. Bye!